Hi everybody, it's Craig at Chicago Electronic Distributors. Um, today I thought we'd do a quick unboxing video of the uh, popular Raspberry Pi 4 desktop kit. So without any further ado, it comes in a really nice package as you can see. Let's see what's inside. This slides up here. Tomorrow is my daughter's seventh birthday, so I'm actually gonna give her one of these. So I'm super excited. Um, she hasn't had a Raspberry Pi before. Anyway, so it comes with the red and white mouse, a white power supply, the Pi official Pi case, an SD card, 16 gig with noobs, the official high keyboard in red and white and two HDMI cables and my personal favorite the official Raspberry Pi beginner's guide so let's take a look at some of these components these are a, this is a really nice keyboard um, and you can buy these individually as well let me open this guy up here So this keyboard, they really kind of have the feel of like an Apple keyboard, um, and it, which is so they're very high quality. That you can tell they did some good benchmarking. Um, this is the North American version of the keyboard. They have different keyboards for different regions, but since most of our customers are in the U.S., this is obviously the only one we sell. So let's plug this in. I've already got a Pi running here. You'll notice um, there was no Pi in that kit. Whenever we sell the kit, we include a Pi 4, but when we receive the kits, they don't actually include the Pi. So anyway, just a just an FYI on why there was no Pi in there. So I've already got one running here. This one happens to have um, a fan shim on it. I've been setting this one up for my daughter. Um, and I figured I'd toss a fan shim on there. I don't know if you can tell, but it is amazingly quiet. The fan shim is really a nice way to keep your Pi cool. So anyway, the, the uh, keyboard plugs into the Pi with this really nice uh, USB to micro USB cable. Then we've got our, oh, this is our official power supply in white. I'm gonna set that aside. I'm using a, using a different one right now. And then this is our official official mouse and you should know every time you buy these official components um, you are supporting the Pi Foundation and all of their efforts um, to for further computer education so um, where you can uh, you know they're really nice components and um, you know we all appreciate it if you kind of support the mission so yeah that's uh you're good to go and it's nice you get a little hub on here too, so you can plug in two, actually three USB components. Um, I've got the mouse plugged in now. And uh, yeah, works nicely. I'm just getting this thing set up for her. Um, uh, what, some of the interesting things I've done, um, I don't really want her surfing the internet or having access to anything. So I've gone and um, I've uh, basically limited uh, the hosts that it'll connect to and manually put in IP addresses for sites like raspberrypi.org and things like that. Um, you know, when I was a kid, <laughs> this was my computer when I was a kid, um, Apple IIc. So didn't really worry about um, things like uh, the internet back then. And, uh, you know, we got more concerns as parents now, I think, than maybe we did in the past. So yeah, I'm excited for it. I think it's gonna, these these kits are really nice. Um, I think you'll like them. Um, we retail them for $120, including the Pi 4, 4 gig, and you really do get everything you need. One thing I did wanna point out, you know, the, the, the monitor cable you get is a micro HDMI to HDMI. And so if your monitor is a DVI monitor, 
or VGA only, this cable will not work. You need an HDMI monitor or you need another adapter. In this case, I actually used a DVI to HDMI adapter. Um, those are readily available on Amazon. We might start selling them because they are super handy. Um, oh, the last thing, the case. So yeah, the case is pretty straightforward. Um, the only thing I don't really like about this case um, is there is no provision for cooling. So you probably want to run it with the Pi without the case top on it. Or you could drill some holes in the top. Yeah, and that's it. Uh, thank you for watching the video and let us know if you have any questions.